doesn't make sense at all. Oh, so much, so much. Well, if you saw the title, there's so much going on. We need your guys' help. It's getting a little overwhelming. I don't even know if any of you are here yet. I'm trying to find Stella. There she is. She's right there. I don't think anybody's watching. I wonder if I went live on the wrong channel. Shoot. How do I know? Share, save, highlight, mute. Oh! People are here. Are we on the live channel? Am I on the correct one? Somebody let me know that, please. Hello, hello. All right, so I'm going to explain. I'm watching. Like, yes, we are on the right channel. So we're going to explain a couple things. Um, there's a lot going on, as we all know. Uh, it's summer. Well, it's not summer, but it's getting, it's feeling like summer because it's nonstop like projects and projects and projects and cleanouts and this and that. And we kind of messed up. So first of all, we're still trying to figure it all out. We were supposed to do a virtual goat snuggle yesterday and we never did it. We were so busy with muck outs. And then we realized, oh, wait a second. We booked ourselves for every single day. Friday store open, Saturday store open, Sunday store open, Monday virtual, Tuesday make soap, Wednesday wacky Wednesday, Thursday make soap, Friday, and it's nonstop and it's unhealthy. So that's where we need your help just to be patient with us, really. Um, that's step one, patience. We might make a little edit to virtual goat snuggles. Um, we're definitely, can I say definitely? For Friday? Uh, I mean, provided nothing Provided happens. nothing happens, because in this day and age, you can't say definite to anything. But Friday, we're going to do a virtual goat snuggles, because what we realized, we can double up. I can run the store on Friday. By the way, that's the gas to our generator, if you were wondering what that orange thing is behind me. I can run the store on Friday, because to be honest, we've never had a customer on a Friday. So that's still in its infancy. So I can run the store on Friday and Liz can do a virtual goat snuggles for you guys. We don't know time yet. Still in that membership level like we talked about. We're going to throw one out there, do it Friday. I actually had to order a little equipment this morning to make it so we can do it again because the old equipment's either broken or missing. A kid stole it. Um, so no, if you're at uh, Claudia, if you're at membership, what level is it? Chaos Crew, it's the $20, $24 level or whatever. Uh, that level and higher puts you in virtual goat snuggles. We had to move it to membership because the old way wasn't working. Now, let me throw it out there. We may do a special, a special like virtual goat snuggle special edition uh, once in a while that we do run the old fashioned way through our a website so people that are non-members can jump in and that'll just be like a one-time special thing um we may do that and we know that that might help some people gift it to other people and things like that we may throw one of those in there it's just logistically lit very difficult to do it that way especially every week and we're not doing it every week on memberships either because we realize we overextended ourselves now warning we're about to talk about food as you know we raise our own food that's vegetables, that's meat, it's all that. The piggies are here. I don't know if you can hear them, but they are here. And we are standing in the pig pen. So I'm going to turn the camera around and show you guys. Now, uh, this all these videos will be coming out soon on the channel. But um, they're delayed, right? Because I still have like five videos coming out before that that are other stuff. Because I'm trying to launch the videos in time sequence and not in chapter not in uh content like put all the pig videos here put all the store videos here no i'm trying to go in time so it's time to see the piggies mom what are you doing in there with the piggies oh, i'm just scratching the bacon so there's four of them as you guys know two of them are ours one is going to be for angie and javier that family and the other is going to be for rob and jenna how come i only see three um, oh. This one's on top of this one. <laughs> oh, yeah. They got a little uh, yeah. pig pile going. Ah, get it? Pig pile? She's the yeah. most shy one. She's the shy one, uh -huh. yeah. Yep. So the feeder's working. We got a feeder video coming soon. They love it. Um, we have, we're going to adjust the feeder possibly and build some type of hopper for it so we can fill it with more food and it's perpetual feeding. They will never not have food. 
Um, and that's it. That's that's what's going on around here. Just we're gonna try to get to virtual goat snuggles. Throw it out on a Friday this week. We know wacky Wednesdays. We just realized we overcommitted to too much stuff, and that's what we're trying to say. We always want to be transparent and honest, and that's what we're doing. So, um, are we getting to work though, or are we scratching pigs all morning? This is work. Oh my gosh. What is it? Tenderizing? What, what are you doing? Spoiling. Spoiling. Got it. Well, I know. Equally we, important. They do have a lot of teats. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. She likes her belly rubbed. Yeah. I like my belly rubbed too. Yeah, you get your belly rubbed. It's fine. No, no don't I don't. Don't complain. Get my belly rubbed. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Come here. Let me rub your belly. Okay. <laughs> I'm not doing it on camera. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, that was funny. Hey, yeah. What are you doing? All right, so I'm sure y'all want to know some names too, right? Oh, somebody just asked, do they have names? Yeah. Okay, so our two pigs are this little one here. She's a girl. And then this boy here. We have three three girls. Hey, three girls and one boy. Um, so this, she loves belly rubs. Um, yep. So she's... Um, She's actually unnamed. I cannot, for the life of me, think of a name for our girl. Um, this one back here, this little black one, she's a girl. And that is Angie and Javier's pig, and her name is Pernille. And they're calling her Pearl for short. Um, and then Robin Jenna's is right here. And I don't know what they've picked out for her yet. And then, hey, the boy right here, he's that big ball white. His name is Hamilton. Um, so we were going to ask for y'all's help in what you think we should name our girl right here. Now she's probably the, I don't know, the most outgoingly friendly one. She loves scratches. She does have a little bit of itchies. Like, I don't know if this is normal for pigs, but she, they, they seem to like to scratch themselves on everything. And they, they even, do. They even have a couple little like scratches from itching themselves so yeah, they, i'm not i'm not sure if they will like rub themselves on everything it's one of the reasons we tried to make it so the metal here none of the sharp edges are yeah. out they can rub on this but they don't have sharp edges and they'll never get this tall they right. won't be that I'm not, but yeah so i'm not sure yeah. you know they're yeah. just a little they got little squidgy things yeah. but she likes to rub her butt up on the thing it's yeah. it's hysterical it's in a little video yesterday yeah. So yeah, By the way, you overfilled this. You know what? I think so. Yeah, Hamlet is hungry. Yeah, push okay? it back. Push it back. He's hungry boy. It will push it back like this because they will push it all over the floor. Pigs are super messy. So if we push it back like that, that'll be better. Then they won't put it all over the floor. All right, Mom, I got to get to work. We've got other things going on, not just farm-related stuff, you know, family stuff, doctor's appointments and haircuts, and the kid needs new sneakers after not going to school for you, and we've never gotten to all that. So yeah. that's what's going on around here. It's just been crazy, and I Have pumped... Have they thrown out some I, pig names? Not yet. I haven't oh, seen okay. any yet. Um, or they did, and I missed them. Mm -hmm. But hang on, live chat. No, I'm on live chat. Miss Piggy. Yeah, we heard that one. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Perneal... <laughs> Well, Perneal is... Piglet. I was thinking Piggles, but I'm just not sure. Yeah. Because she likes to wiggle her Piggle. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, Pork Chop. Yeah. Sophie? So, so, uh, no, I, I don't know. Right. Oh, Bacon. Yeah. Yeah, but she's a girl. Yeah. So it's hard. Miss Bacon. We thought about Kevin Bacon, but... And Stella's not a fan, just so we all know. Oh, Stella. Stella? They haven't learned how to use the oh, water geez, nipples yet. Sorry. Yes. Yeah. They sure? haven't learned how to use these yet, so They're they still... bite on it and they get water. But yesterday, Pernille got think onto, I... like got a little squirt, but I don't think she so, realized what had happened. So you'll find in a new video coming, the original mounting point was too high because they're so little, so we had to bring it down and strap it up with some twine and stuff. But okay, Temporary. it's time. You guys just sleep, I guess. That's what you do. Just sleep. Okay. Well, they ate all morning. Yeah. So, um, I think there might have been a Charlotte, uh... Yeah, we already have a Charlotte, though. Well, Charlotte's Web, get I it? I know. Yeah. Um, what's that one? Uh, Harriet. Yeah, I was thinking of, like, Petunia. How old are they? They are, like, 
six, six weeks, weeks old. Yeah. Six or seven weeks. Yeah, so we were thinking there. that they were going to be closer to eight weeks old. They I was can't hoping. shoot that way. Yeah, no. I was hoping they'd be eight weeks old, but when we asked the guy yeah. yesterday, he we're was like, six. yeah, they're six weeks old. I'm like, oh, okay. So, yeah. uh, but, but they're, they're, doing they're eating and... They're eating, know. they're drinking, they're not coughing, they're doing good. They're doing good. Yeah, they are, actually. All right, lock them all back up. They're little, but look at the size of this chain. Again, coming soon in a video, eventually, like a week. Look at the size of that. That chain can hold like 1,300 pounds, I think it was. You know, and the yeah. carabiner alone can do like 900 or something. It's massive. Yeah, you and we just, have two of them just in case. Two of them, yeah, just in case. Yeah, I put the other one over here, by the way. Yeah, that's fine. So bad. I do have to wash my hands before. Yeah, so that's what we wanted to say. We needed your help, maybe a pig name, but also bear with us. Uh, oh, what kind of pigs are they? So they're mutts, but they're heritage breeds, uh, and there's like there's, Ham, there's a, Hampshire and Yorkshire. Ham, Berkshire. Ber yeah, those were the two that I remember. Berkshire and Hampshire are the two in there. Um, but they're basically considered big pink piggies, you know? Um, well, two of them are. Yeah, two of them are. Um, so that's what they are. So yeah bear with us with all the timing and scheduling and all that stuff and we understand if somebody signed up for membership to do virtuals on monday because it worked and now a friday won't or an unpredictable schedule won't just let us know like if you got to cancel your membership because that's just not going to work do it and then let us know and we'll see if we can get you that one month refund because i know we're confusing but life is confusing and when you realize wait a second we booked every single day not a single day with nothing that's not on it. And that's not even including Q&As. I never even said that with Q&As and all that kind of stuff. And the kids are asking to go hiking and the pool still doesn't work because we don't have a pool liner and there's just, yeah, it's just a lot. So, uh, Wilbur, um, nothing, hey, giraffe love 21, nothing really happened. You'll have to go back and watch. We just uh, got a little stressed out, a little overwhelmed with all the scheduling stuff, so. And the piggies are here, so that's it. I, we gotta get back to work, back into the barn, to the other live camera over that way. And we will uh, talk to you guys later. Yeah, the goats are like, come on, we're not the center of attention anymore. Yeah, welcome to the real world, exactly. And if, I, like Liz says, our audience is amazing, they'll understand. We just like to be transparent when I know it's Oh, it's Tuesday. Yesterday was Monday and we didn't do virtual, but we mucked out all day and we built the, finished the pig pen, went and got the pigs and we missed the virtual and we're like, oh, I hate committing to something and not doing it. So that's it. That's what we wanted to say. So yeah, Moo and Rainy are hungry. You're right. We got to get back to work. See you guys later.